Many of you will see Prince Louis happening in Denver. Seahawks, Donald Broncos, Prince twin brothers Shaquille and Shaquille Griffin, both starting on defense for the Seahawks today. Of course, Shaquille, the fifth round draft pick out of Central Florida, who had his left hand amputated when he was a kid due to a congenital disease in the starting lineup for the Seahawks. Proving this preseason, and he's not just a field good story, he's a heck of a football player. Heck, right? he's, the, really the, he's the player of the year in his conference in college. I mean, on an undefeated team out of Central undefeated Florida. Undefeated team out of Central Florida who made themselves ring because they said they were national champs because they didn't get invited to that game. But he and his brother, I mean, it's a, it's a dream to be able to play with your brother and say you both can play in the NFL. But to be twins, have that special bond, I know, with, with my twin girls, and to be able to play at this level, as a, as a parent, you must be proud. But to have that safety blanket, that brother, right there with you is really something special as well. So this is just a feel good story all around. I mean, the, you know, the, the Shaquille, his, his, what everybody thought was limitations, he showed there are no limits to what he can do. And Shaquille, he's the guy who's coming in to fill big shoes. Richard Sherman, all the late legions of boom, he is that next level for the Seahawks. He was only on the fastest linebacker at the combine. He blew it up. He's back and well, he didn't even get invited to the combine yeah. initially. Yeah. Right. Then yeah. once he got there, he blew up everything, as you said, the fastest guy. He's got the chance to start because of the injury to K.J. Wright, yep. but he's a guy they're expecting to do big things as a rookie this season. Big like on weak side. Led the team in tackles in the preseason. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, a really good, really good story. He and his brother Shaquille will take on the Denver Broncos. The first half of the games are wrapped up. America's Game of the Week comes your way in just